five rushing touchdowns for the Crusaders today. Three of them belong to that man, our player of the game, Tory Lambert. Yeah, I mean, tremendous game. 263 rushing yards, and it was almost like it was quiet rushing yards there. He came up with a great catch, but he really broke some long runs there. 33 times. We knew he was kind of the bell cow of this football team, but he ran it there 33 times for 263 yards and three touchdowns. I wish I had him on my fantasy team. Garrett, that, that's, that'd be a lot of points there, uh, but tremendous player, just a junior. And we saw him, watch this one, break the tackle, get to the outside, shows off his speed. Nobody catches him and houses another one. Had us looking in the record books. How close was that? Well, he's 100 yards shy of Bruce Jordan Swilling, who ran for 365 against Miles Brennan and St. Stanislaus back in 2015. Let's take a look at the final numbers. Yeah, and you can see here, uh, Brother Martin running it for 346 yards. And then, obviously, total yards, 379. 15 first downs, and, and just St. Aug was not able to put up the same kind of offensive production. Also had a turnover here or there, and so that's why you have your score 45-21. Brother Martin also was able to start with much better field position than St. Aug, and I think that was another, another key difference, Gary. 3-0 for Brother Martin, 0-3 for St. Aug. They'll try and get their first win of the season next week. Next week, be sure to join us as we move into week five. We'll be in Lafayette, Louisiana, as the Westgate Tigers get set to host the St. Thomas More Cougars. Be sure to tune in 7 p.m. next Friday right here on Your You. And for those who choose to watch online, be sure to visit yourview.com to tune in. That's St. Thomas More versus Westgate next Friday. Well, Brother Martin puts one in the history books in today's matchup for this rivalry game. Clayton Leonardo moving forward has got to feel great about his running game. He had a passing touchdown as well. Javon Nicholas for St. Augustine. He'll have an opportunity to try and improve next week. A 45-21 victory for the Crusaders over the Purple Knights. You have been watching Game Time on your view.